And if you'd like to take a look at these comments Tánis the Micheál Martin made at the Fianna Fáil thinking in Tipperary today. But they've been very, very slow to bring closure to many victims of provisional and IRA violence. Um, and as a recent document, document film, which I believe would show an RT on the, the murder of Thomas uh, Niedemar, and I think that is sobering watching for anybody. But it reminds us of the need for Sinn Féin not to triumphalise the horrible deeds that they did. And they still triumphalise it, and they're still trying to justify it. And the problem for that is really that you're infecting a new generation of young people. Uh, Louise O'Reilly, I just want to get your reaction to that. The Thornish, the strong language there, infecting a new generation of young people because of your justification of IRA violence in his view. What's your reaction to it? Well, you know, I, I suppose the, we've said this a number of times, you know, it, it, it's, we live rent free in Micheál Martin's head. It's his party's thinking. Um, I would have thought that he would focus perhaps on their poor performance in the polls. I would hope that he might focus on something like housing, which if you talk to young people, and I do, uh, they will tell you that they are fearful of being left abandoned mm -hmm. in the back bedroom in their parents' house, that they may never uh, okay. be able to Are you offended by those comments you heard? I would very rarely get offended by anything Micheál Martin says. And what about your supporters? Uh, what about your support base? Would you imagine they are talking I don't about think uh, their that, minds uh, being infected? No, I don't think people pay too much attention to uh, to what Micheál Martin says when he's on one of those rants because they see it for what it is. You know, he doesn't want to talk about housing. He doesn't want to talk about health. He doesn't want to talk about the cost of living. He wants to talk right. only about uh, the largest party in the state and the party that leads the opposition. There is a reason for that. It's politically motivated but I really do wish that he could summon up even a percentage a small percentage of the passion that he appears to have um, you know when he discusses okay. my party if he could just summon a little bit of focus from perhaps the housing crisis the cost of living crisis or um, indeed All the right. health crisis.